welcome to select ev news and here is the first news this news is all about indian railways in next to 3 years indian railways are going to plan to set up electric vehicle charging stations in major cities in first phase they are going to select to 40 lakhs and above people located in those cities and then they are going to release in those cities and in the second phase they are going to select to 10 lakhs and above people located in those cities and then they are going to release in those cities and in the first phase releasing the cities are mumbai delhi bangalore hyderabad ahmedabad kolkata pune and surat in these cities they are going to release in the first phase electric charging stations if the charging stations are available in railway stations so we can charge easily to your bikes but it is not for free it is chargeable indian railways are not going to set up their own charging stations they tie up with the manufacturing charging stations and they take the partnership with them wanted to locate nearby charging stations wanted to know about discounts and offers from dealers looking for electric vehicle accessories then download select ev application you will find every information regarding electric vehicles and then we are going to the next news the increased power tariff is doubled and perhaps more than the commercial tariff after the changes made as per the release of new power tariff structure in tamil nadu The energy charges have increased by 49%. That is from 8 rupees to 12 rupees. From 70 to 330 kilowatts means below 112 kilowatts. Even though Tamil Nadu is in competition with other states in its revised costs, but the fixed charges have peaked to the sky by nearly hitting 3.5, which is actually agonizing. In January 2022, the Ministry of Power has suggested all the state discoms to exempt the demand charges on charging stations. They are also in discussions with Tamil Nadu to support the EV ecosystem for upcoming three years. And we are moving to the next news. Mahindra has recently launched their new vehicle called XUV 400 electric vehicle. This car delivers our starts from January. Before the delivery, they are going to start the charging stations. To set up these charging stations, they are taking partnership with Jio BP. Mahindra and Mahindra are going to tie up with Jio BP and going to set up and dealership and service stations and charging stations in first phase they are going to select the 16 cities and start state partnership after they will starts in every city and here is the next news the bvd ev manufacturer supported by baron buffett has launched its new passenger vehicle on monday in indore the shub bvd showroom has 3414 square feet periphery and house service equipment customer launch heaving charging stations and a showroom display fort in 2007 the launch of a first bvd india took place in chennai with its office in new delhi with over 200 million us dollars investment the two factories owned by the company has 140000 square meters area the product solutions and after sales related services include business covers mobile components battery energy storage electric buses electric trucks and electrics and electric 4k lifts etc sanjay gopal krishnan senior vice president of electric passenger vehicle expressed his happiness about launching bvd new store along with the announcement of electric suv bvd atmo 3 mandan for shub bvd also mentioned that ev cars showroom launch in indoor is all set to give a cleaner and greener ride in the city maintaining city's cleanliness record the indian government is targeting 30% ev penetration for the pv segment by 2030 and net zero emissions by 2070 here is the next news uh, it is all about ultraviolet automotive and here is the sports bike ultraviolet f77 and the release date is also confirmed in this november 22 They are going to launch the bike ultraviolet, and they conducted a event about the ultraviolet. In this event, they released some specifications about that event. These bike bookings are going to start from October 23rd onwards, and we have to pay 10,000 as advance to book that bike. And this bike having a fixed battery, and in this bike produce 33 bhp power. And in this, it covers 0 to 60 kilometers at 2.9 seconds only. and coming to top speed it is having 147 km skywood range in electric vehicle industry this bike is only have abs channel ultraviolet expected price is 3 lakhs to 3.5 lakhs and we are moving to the next news 
light commercial vehicles and electric vehicles to replace the garbage push carts in Coimbatore. The first batch of deployment begins in November with nearly 1 out 5 electric vehicles. A total of 7.82 crores is spent on 1 out 5 vehicles with 7.45 lakh being the cost of single unit. There are plans of acquiring 100 more vehicles. Besides light commercial vehicles, EVs of 2.5 lakh per unit will be bought soon for the garbage purpose. Probably within two months, the door-to-door -door gave service will witness three models of vehicles. And we are next going to discuss the news about from the Rolls-Royce. Rolls-Royce electric vehicle, it is the king of cars in this. They are testing in some many years. Now the testing comes to the final stage. Rolls-Royce Spectra has started a new electric car and they kept a name called Rolls-Royce Spectra and they are going to release 2023. And this is two-door car and it has four seats. In this having advanced and tech futures, it comes with a range of 520 km IDC range, 0 to 100 km speed it covers in 3.4 seconds only. And coming to price, it is approximately 7 to 9 crores. And we are moving to the last but not the least news. Greaves Electric Mobility Private Limited has proudly achieved the milestone of servicing more than 1 lakh electric vehicles in the last 6 months spread across 250 cities with more than 350 service points. All the periodic, accidental, warranty and general repairs with roadside assistance and 5 years warranty. Greaves extended its unmatched service. Sanjay Bell, CEO of Greaves, expressed his happiness towards this achievement. He also added that along with their brand Ampere, making its significance in the electric scooter zone, the post-sales services extended by Greaves is a real success. I hope you people enjoy the video. If you like the video, please do like, share, comment and subscribe. Thanks for watching.